Jesus said to me, Tea is mine. It was a riddle. But when he said that, I had understanding that he was saying, Tara, you are mine. Tara, you are mine. And the answer to the riddle is the word smitten. I'll show you at the end of the song. But today's song is Jesus speaking to me, Jesus speaking to you, those who are his beloved. You are mine till the end of time. Nothing can get in the way of our love. And in time you'll find haters, they're just going to hate. I mean, I've got people in my life right now that like I catch them glaring at me. Haters, they're just going to hate. I can't help that I am who I am in Christ. I'm like a little child and I'm a pure heart. And some people like don't like that. Haters, they're just going to hate. But I mean, I know the love of God in a way that, you know, they don't like it. So stay close to me. I'll draw you near. That's what Jesus is saying to us. Stay close to me. I'll draw you near. Everything will work out fine because the love we have is shining bright into the darkness of night. This world is a place of darkness of night and the love we have is shining a light in the darkness. The love we have, the love we know of our Lord, he's using us as lights to shine in the darkness. You are mine till the end of time. Nothing can stop our love. And in time, you will find the haters, they're gonna hate. So stay close to me, I'll draw you near. Everything will work out fine, cause the love we have is shining bright. Of light in the dark of night. You are mine till the end of time. Nothing can stop our love. And in time, you will find the haters, they're gonna hate. So stay close to me, I'll draw you near, everything will work out fine, cause the love we have is shining bright, a light in the dark of night. You are mine till the end of time. Nothing can stop our love. Nothing can get in the way of our love. That is what Jesus is telling us. That is what God is telling us. Nothing can get in the way of our love. And in time you'll find haters, they just gonna hate. I was at church yesterday and caught a person glaring at me. The same person who I asked God, why are they not receiving me? And he said, because they think they're more mature than you. I mean, talk about spiritual pride. And then yesterday I catch them glaring at me. I mean, I'm like no threat to anyone, right? But in terms of what's going on in the spirit, maybe I am a threat. Maybe my light shines a little too bright for some to handle. It's just something that happens in the spirit. Spiritual warfare is real. It really is real. And people with the wrong spirit don't like those who have the right spirit. Haters, they just gonna hate. And I've experienced it hundreds of times as God has sent me into the churches because he has. That is something that God has me do. I go into the churches. 
and take like the temperature. He lets me take the temperature of the churches. And most churches are sick, are very, very sick. All right. So stay close to me. I'll draw you near, is what Jesus is saying. Everything will work out fine because the love we have is shining bright into the darkness of night. We are literally like the flashlight that God is using to shine in the darkness. And why do we shine? Because we are filled with the love of God. He is smitten with us. I will show you that riddle, answer to the riddle. He is smitten with us. Tower, you're mine. T is mine. And the word smitten. So T is mine. Well, it's a riddle. So he gave me the answer to the riddle with understanding of what the solve is. Riddles are riddles. There's a little bit more to them than they first appear. So remember, God said, Tara, you are a witness of these things. And then he gave me the download of the Bible two times, the secret things and the revealed things. So I've seen some stuff. Just like John the Revelator saw some stuff, I've seen some stuff, all right? But he said, Tara, you're a witness of these things. Two T's, a double T. T-T. -t. Two T's. So T is the 20th letter. 2020 is to be able to see clearly, to see clearly. Well, spiritually speaking, we've got to see clearly also. If our glasses are foggy, we're not going to see very well. So we've got to clean off our glasses, spiritually speaking. And because I'm a witness of these things, God has given me eyes to see, a double T. So I'm a witness of these things, two T's. I've got to use the T two times. T is mine. S-M-I-T-T. E-N. To be smitten is to be so in love with that you just don't know what to do with yourself. That's how Jesus feels about us. He is smitten. I know he's told me that he is, that I belong to him, and that he is smitten. All right, that's another riddle. God bless you.